Janice La Martina says she has struggled with mental health issues since she was a young child. I remember being in school and having a lot of anxiety and a lot of issues. I was It was recommended that I put on medication for hyperactivity. She says she also dealt with depression and admits to substance abuse throughout her youth to cope. I had no really way to cope with the things that had been left untreated. Janice abused alcohol and pain medication and after going through several recovery programs and relapsing, she ended up homeless and then in jail, which she says was a blessing because she ended up at Harbor Homes in Nashua. When I came out of prison, uh, I think it was 2010, I, um, I went to their, their um, homeless shelter. That's when she met clinical social worker Elizabeth McGuire. Frequently I see people who have had a lot of trauma in their lives, um, depression, anxiety, um, so they try to numb out the pain through the use of a substance. The government agency that deals with substance misuse and mental illness says nearly 8 million adults have both a mental health disorder and substance abuse issue, according to a 2014 survey. Elizabeth says when working with these patients, counselors need to treat both at the same time. Using mental health services helps people um, get through whatever reason that they are using. With the help of Elizabeth, Janice addressed those issues and is now living a more fulfilling life, working for a recovery center in Nashua called Destinations Wellness, helping others get clean. I get to, I get to relate to a lot of people at a lot of different levels and, uh, and definitely, hopefully, be a help to them. In Nashua, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.